Can I ask you something? Am I look like a girl? No, I don't think so. Even though I have four inch heels. See, cup breasts. Long hair. And dramatic makeup. Look. Two kind of girls are walking down the street. Stop. One more time. One girl. And one crossdresser. I'm certain this is a man. Let's take a look at his face. Are you seeing this makeup? So, dramatic makeup is the primary sign of cross-dress girl. Here is another example of such pretty nice girl until he moved in a little closer. Such vivid colors. Now, let's look down. Legs. I really like her boots. So cute and sexy. But, this is not easy job to walk like that for a long distance. Look, she gave up. Undoubtedly cross-dressers are too optimistic about ability to wear high heels. What the difference between man and woman? Breasts. Unfortunately unaccessible for CDs. Here is very cute cocktail dress, which cross-dresser never dress up. Why? Because Look how awful it looks with silicone breasts forms. Obviously, no way. But at least modern technologies help us to resolve this issue somehow. This beauty once was walking through the streets of my city. What a femininity. Body, legs, high heels and breasts. I really though she is a woman. Until he came out under direct sunlight. And of course, glossy panta has sold him. One more common cross-dresser's mistake. Now I want to demonstrate you what happens if fixed majority of those issues. First of all, avoid too high heels. Boots with two inches heels looks feminine enough and stay comfortable. Secondly, wear casual clothes, like jeans. And of course, woman's model. Well, this is a man. Not in a dress, but in woman's clothes indeed. With long hairs and makeup. Goes for shopping in a daily light.
And yet, I do not like to walk like that. Cross-dressing is not about such outfit. 